Uh, I have a question for you. You probably know what it's going to be. What was it like working with Martin Campbell? Oh my God! It was, it was a curveball. You didn't expect that. <laughs> nice. It was great. Right? Yeah, I'm a. I mean, coming into it, we had we were actually like rewatching his films as I was filming. Casino Royale, Goldeneye, Mask of Zorro. I mean, like iconic films, and I feel like his sensibility runs through Cleaner so much. Like you should, you should tell people what it's about for people that don't realize. Uh, so Cleaner is about a woman, me, who is a window cleaner and is outside um, a building cleaning some windows and um, everything sort of gets a little strange inside the building and basically some eco activists have stormed the building and have some terms to be uh, met. And it just so happens that my character knows MMA. <laughs> and, and knows how to shoot. Um, so, so my character gets in touch with the police and I have to fight my way in, fight off the bad guys. It was really uh, intense. It's funny because I'm mid shooting something now, which is like, yeah, a few takes onwards. Like Martin is a real perfectionist and it was amazing. Like one of his notes was, just didn't feel it that time, try again. And you're like, okay. Um, but it's, it, there's always humor in his films, obviously amazing action, but it was so, it's like a classic action movie, but emotionally it was amazing, like a real exploration. The guy that plays my brother is called Matt. He's amazing, never acted in anything before. And really my character's motivation is getting to her brother who she has done wrong by. Uh, so it's very, and amongst all this craziness, it's very beautiful coming together of these siblings. One of the things about Martin and his work, and because I've watched all of it, mm. is his action is very stylistic. Mm. And what, you've obviously done action before, mm. but what was unique about the role in terms of pushing you as an actor that mm. maybe you haven't done before? I would say this is probably the toughest action I've done. When we came to, I have a fight with, uh, well, I have two big fights. And it was interesting because we were trying to research really good female action, like women fighting women. And it's not that easy to come by. Like Atomic Blonde is a is a good recent one. And there are bits and bobs, but we, uh, the intention of the stunt team and Martin and me was that the fights would be brutal. Like just as brutal between me and the woman I fight and then between me and the guy I fight. Um, <coughs> so it was, uh, it was, it was tough. But because I've done other action-y stuff, you know that you've just got that bit inside you. You're like, I think I can't do it again, but I can sure. and I shall. Mm. Um, yeah, but I'm, I'm excited. Uh, I believe there's a first cut happening currently and people are watching it. Um, yeah, it was really like, he is amazing. And strangely, he reminds me of my dad. So I was like, Martin. Um, yeah, I'm excited. Uh, I just got to ask you real fast, and you know I'm going to ask about this. We all, she's part of this franchise called Star Wars. <laughs> it's not popular, but there's a few people that like it. Um, so there's there's talk that the the film that you guys are going to do is called New Jedi Order. Is that is that actually what it's called, or is this like? I don't know. Right? <laughs> I mean, I think so. That, I, I, was, that was announced. I, I, listen, I've seen it online a bunch, yeah. and I'm like, I think so. But you know, you know the way it is over there. Things yeah. change. Yeah, I mean, from the announcement, I, I don't think that's changed. Uh, I know a script is happening and I'm going to be reading it imminently, which is very exciting. <clears throat> Do you think that there's a chance that it is filming at some point this, have they actually said, Daisy, we want you to save some dates? Or is it one of these things where it could be this year, it could be next year, you don't? Uh, I think it could be this year. Because there, I read that it, it was gonna film later this year, but I don't know if that's true. It could be. But I'm not sure. I think, to be honest, the writer's strike has obviously delayed quite a lot of things. Um, so the intention was later this year. Uh, hopefully it will be. Uh, otherwise, top of next, I would imagine.